Hi there, I'm Eitan and welcome to Wix Fixer. In the previous video, I showed you how to install a Lottie animation on your Wix website using the Wix Lottie integration. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you what to do if you have a JSON file and you want to host it yourself. Um, so one option would be to upload it to Lottie, but if you want to keep it private, then another option would be to host it on any other web service and we're going to be using GitHub. So let's get started. Okay, so over here I have the JSON file, and you can see here that it looks like unintelligible uh, garble, um, but this is something that you might get from, you know, your designer or something, somebody who created an animation for you. And the first step to integrating this into your Wix website would be to store it somewhere and host it somewhere so you can get a link to this JSON file because right now it's only on your computer. So I'm going to be doing that using uh, gist. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy over this entire file by doing control A, control C, and I'm going to head over to gist.github.com. And if you don't have a GitHub account, you're going to have to open a GitHub account. It's completely free. And what I'm going to do here, I'm going to call this uh, example. Whoops, that's Hebrew. <laughs> I'm going to call this example.json and I'm just going to paste the content of my JSON animation right over here. And then you just have to click here to create secret gist. You can also create a public gist. Um, but since I want this to be my own intellectual property, I don't want other people using this. Uh, I'm going to create a secret gist. And awesome. Now that my gist is ready, uh, it, uh, for those of you who are not familiar, a gist is basically another way of storing a code snippet. Uh, usually I'll use it when I'm trying to kind of embed a code example in, in my website or something like that. But you can also just get the raw file by clicking right over here, raw, and it's going to take us to a URL, which if you look at the end of the URL, you'll see that it ends in .json. Okay, example.json. And that basically means that this is a JSON file that's being stored on GitHub. And I can just go ahead and copy this uh, JSON link and head back over to my uh, Wix website. And right over here, I have the animation that I added last time from Lottie Files. Uh, if you missed that video, it's the one right before this, so you can go check it out. And what I'm gonna do here is I'm just gonna change the animation to the link that I just got from my gist. So I'm going to go ahead and, and paste that right there. And then I'm going to click uh, change, whoops, not change animation. I'm just going to click enter. Uh, and now you can see the new animation here that we stored on GitHub. Uh, so that's how to store your own uh, JSON animation file uh, on GitHub and use the Lottie extension on Wix to embed it into your website. Um, it's not playing right now because we're not in preview mode, but if I head into preview mode, then you'll see that this guy will start biking around. Okay, so the animation is working. Uh, and if you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.